Kimi Antonelli still struggling to find the breaking setup into that corner. And I say breaking setup because there's more than just brake balance. It could be the brake balance. It could be the brake migration. It could be the engine braking. Wind the brake balance back a little bit, but not too much because you're giving away braking potential. And the steering comes on later in the corner. But I'd put that one on hold for now. I'd really target the other two first. So the engine braking has to go up quite a lot. You really want to pull back with the gears and just give the brakes a little bit of an easier time. But that does swallow fuel and that's going to be a penalty in the race as well. You're going to have to start the race with more fuel if that's your technique in to there the best and most elegant solution is brake migration so starting the brake balance further forward and migrating it to the rear as that corner unfolds is the way to go it's tricky because in that corner you put on the brakes progressively because you're turning but then you take them off progressively as well so you need to map in a migration uh, brake migration there that starts the brake balance at i don't know 56 44 for example but then runs it away closer to 50 50 maybe 52 48 something like that so you want to migrate your brake balance throughout the braking phase because the lockup doesn't happen on the initial contact it happens always like later in the braking phase when the steering comes on and the load comes across <laughs>